My name is Cameron Neal and I'm a video artist, graphic designer, and performance maker coming to you pre-recorded from my apartment in Brooklyn, New York. And this module together will be talking about the lineage of self-portraiture in today's social media landscape. We'll look at some early forms of self-portraiture, stop motion animation, and explore ways to tell compelling stories through movement and gesture. Then we'll make some short form stop motion self-portrait GIFs together. All you'll need for this module is a smartphone with a front facing camera, a free version of the stop motion studio app installed on your phone and your ideas and your body. A tripod is optional, but recommended but you can always get creative by propping your phone on a shelf, using books, or anything you find in your home can serve as a tripod stand-in. So by way of introduction, I wanted to share a little bit about my own work as I'll be dissecting one of my pieces and we'll be using it as a springboard for the work we'll make together later. I've often used video and technology as a tool to start understanding my own identity and reimagine some of the awkward scenarios of my youth. I also collaborate with artists in theater and music and in dance to think creatively about how to bring video and body into conversation in real time. Groundwater is a projection mapped video self-portrait that kind of plays on the idea of drowning in your sorrows. It's a loop where the frame fills up with my tears and then the piece kind of starts over again. It's also about rising tides, intimacy inside of relationships and bodily fluids. This is how the piece was displayed at a projection festival in Florida called Digital Graffiti. Kale Salad is a video piece and a self-portrait of sorts that was originally designed to be projected on the ceiling of an off-Broadway theater. I was thinking about who has access to health foods and what it would mean to place my body in a surreal kind of futuristic kale salad equipped with everything from gummy bears to hot sauce and pink Afro picks. And finally, Liquid Love is a stop motion self-portrait that I created in 2016. You'll see that the background is rapidly changing while I'm stationary and performing this exaggerated gesture. Um, in the piece, I was thinking a lot about the popularization of this kind of conversation around self-love and what would it mean to kind of represent that um, through movement. And we'll talk about this piece a lot more later in the module and I'll also kind of break down how I made the gesture and that will kind of inform what we end up doing later. So, see you in part two.